Hey everybody, welcome to my new series, The Quick and Dirty with Doc. I'm Dr. Keelan Redmond, and I'm here to give you a little bit of information about a little piece of equine medicine. This is my assistant and male model tag, Hairstyle Inspiration by Rod Stewart. And he and I are here to tell you today about the equine neck. First thing, anatomy. Where is the neck? There's a lot of confusion about this. This is the vertebral column of the neck. This is the chain of bones that houses the spinal cord. This is not where the vertebral column of the neck is. This is not where the vertebral column of the neck is. This is also not the vertebral column of the neck. So now that we understand that, there are seven vertebrae in the neck, seven little blocks of bone that house the spinal cord. This is consistent between species. Tag has seven cervical vertebrae. I have seven cervical vertebrae. Shuli has seven cervical vertebrae. Delta, it's hard to say really. Two, none. Anyway, everybody else has seven cervical vertebrae. You can feel the vertebrae here as bump, 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 bump. Don't poke it, don't stick needles in it. What can you do with the equine neck? If you're trained in giving IM shots, intramuscular shots, you can give it in this flat muscle right here. You wanna be above the vertebral column, below the nuchal ligament, this is the nuchal ligament, and you wanna be below it, and in front of the shoulder blade. What else can you do with the equine neck? Passive stretching. What is passive stretching? That's stretching that's done very gently and very voluntarily on the horse's part. I do it with treats. I ask Tag to just reach his neck around to the elbow here. Remember, very gentle, very passive, and you wanna do that on both sides. Be a little careful if you have a very food-motivated horse because they can get a little crazy and hurt their neck. If I saw a Snickers bar and a glass of Prosecco in front of a moving train, I would hurt myself to get it. And if your horse is that guy, be a little careful with the stretching. That's a very quick and dirty version of the equine neck. There's a lot more information out there. Remember, this is just enough to make you dangerous. Thanks for joining and I'll see you next time.